Hi, today I'm going to show you how to use MyFlightBook's search capabilities to do analysis. And this is particularly useful for things like in answering all of those pesky insurance questions where they want to know how many hours do you have in purple airplanes in months that end in Y. Uh, it's actually one of the reasons I made my flight book is that doing those kinds of queries were, were bothersome <laughs> and uh, pain in the neck. Uh, but my idea is to try to make that as easy as possible. So if you go to your logbook, uh, and open up the search tab, you'll see a actually pretty rich form here with a lot of capabilities for uh, narrowing your, uh, your logbook or filtering your logbook. And that actually is how search works. It is a filter. Um, so by default, you're viewing all of your flights here. But if you want to see, for example, just your flights from uh, the, the past 12 months, then you can click here in the flight dates and say find matching flights. And when you do that, you'll notice that there's a little bar here that tells you what filter is applied and it says I'm only showing you stuff from the past 12 months. And so the, uh, the flights here, I now only have two pages of flights. And if I go to totals, that's now only showing me my totals for the last uh, 12 months. Similarly, if I go to analysis, that's only going to do analysis on my flights for the past uh, 12 months. And so if I'm looking at total flight time or how much night time I have, uh, which is not much, <laughs> that's only for the past uh, 12 months. Similarly, you can print out a subset of your uh, logbook. It will, be, uh, it, it will also respect uh, the search filter that is applied here. To get rid of the search filter, just click the little red X next to it. And uh, and now it's showing your whole logbook. I'm back up to 37 pages. My totals are a lot bigger and a lot more involved. One handy thing to be able to do is if you go into totals, you'll see that each of the totals is something you can click. And so if you just want to see, for example, your, in this case, I'll look at my seaplane flights. I can click on ASES. And that will also filter. So here, the category class is one of ASES. Uh, and so if I want to see uh, only those flights that are uh, seaplane flights, uh, but in, in which I logged pilot and command time, so after I got my license, now that's just going to add PIC time as a second uh, uh, criteria in, in the search bar here. And again, if I click on totals, that will now be filtered just by uh, uh, the flights in which I have PIC time in a seaplane. And if I want to know, ooh, how much P where was the, where were those flights where I had PIC time in a high performance seaplane? Again, I can click it, and now I've added even more uh, criteria. And you can see that that it just sort of filters it down uh, each time. And I just have to click to get rid of a. Um, of a criteria here. So if I get rid of the high performance, I'm back to all uh, of my seaplane time. Now you may find yourself doing the same kind of search over and over. And so there is an option here, uh, right next to fly, find matching flights. If you click on the little downward facing arrow, you can name the current query and then click ma find matching flights and that creates a named query. Or you can pick from previously uh, defined queries. So if I uh, uh, click on angel flights, I can see all of my angel flights. See, it contains the word angel. Uh, if I click on 172, I'm just seeing my flights where the model contains a 172. Uh, so that's a really handy way to be able to uh, pull up existing queries at uh, uh, very quickly uh, that you that you do over and over and that capable all of this capability is available on the Android app and on the iOS app so if you go into your totals you can tap on a totals item uh, in iOS or Android and see the resulting flights uh, and you can name queries and pick uh, from named queries so hopefully that will help you to be able to quickly answer questions like your annual insurance questions about what kind of flying uh, experience you have. Thanks.